Hold it, Snake. Time to change the disc. I know, I know, it's a pain. But you need to swap disc one for disc two. You see the disc labeled two? No. Uh, no. Huh? Oh, wait. We're on PlayStation 3. It's a Blu-ray disc. Dual layered, too. No need to swap. Damn it, Otacon. Get a grip. <laughs> yeah, what an age we live in, huh, Snake? Wonder what they'll think of next. <laughs> I've got something to tell you about Naomi Hunter. What about her? She might be a spy. To kill me? Is that all you cared about? Frank Yeager. The man who you destroyed was my brother and my only family. Great Fox. You killed my benefactor and sent my brother home a cripple. I vowed revenge. But I can't go yet. I still have a job to do. I vowed revenge. En route.
spawn, Snake. I'll send her up. Afraid so. Unfortunately for you, the railgun is no longer here. Naomi. This place will be your grave, as my queen wishes. The suicide gecko are on their way. Soon. There'll be nothing left of this place. We've been had. All gone. Snake, I think I might be able to get it working. I just need some time. Hurry! Mm. I'll leave the rest to you. Naomi!
it, Snake!
pull it through their brains. Gecko are blinking. When they stop blinking, it'll blow. Don't let that happen. Good snake.
He was never an immortal. His natural healing abilities were enhanced by the nanomachines inside his body. But, after so many battles, he's finally reached his limit. Doctor, ease my pain. <laughs> tell you something. What is it? I cooked them right. I see. Good for you, Sonny. You finally did it. No, I can't save you. You have to trust me, Dr. M. Give this to him. Not for revenge, but to end his suffering. Snake. Liquid's down below us. He's stolen the Patriot system, slipped out of their sight, and taken their Ark. Ark? A warship, unfettered by land, law, country, or network. The only place where they are truly released from the shackles of the Patriots. The place where they can be free. Outer Haven. Outer Haven? Liquid plans to launch the nuke from that ship. Huh. Snake. You have been given life so that you may fulfill your purpose. When all of this is over, you'll have no choice but to accept death. We are given life only so that we can atone for our sins. Your life was created for that very purpose. We all must atone for our own sins. We must not pass them on to the next generation. We must not leave them for the future. That is your true fate. One that even you cannot defy. Naomi! What have you done? Vamp and I, we are the same. We're living corpses. Our bodies kept barely alive by nanomachines. Cancer. I shouldn't even be alive right now. The nanomachines have kept it from progressing. But there's nothing more they can do. With 
the nano machines gone, time will unfreeze and begin to flow again. What are you saying? Goodbye. Hell. <gasps> Time's running short, so I'll explain as we go. Pay close attention. I'm listening. 